is the mission of Jack Rabbit Sports. Simply put, the well, I didn't mean to say that. Is that bad? <laughs> this came naturally that time. That was good. We couldn't have planned that better. What's up, everybody? I'm Emmanuel Lacho, and this is Simply Put, where complex business challenges get clear solutions. Here's how it works. If things get too bogged down in techno babble, one of these will appear with language people actually use. For example, if someone says, optimize your tech stack and crush your KPIs by leveraging a low to no code digital commerce platform, our translation will read, simply put, sell online. This season, we're training to hit a personal best with the digital pros at Jackrabbit Sports. We're about to check back in with Patrick Jacobs, Chief Digital Officer at Jackrabbit. And later on, Salesforce Director of Product Marketing, Loretta Shen, will help us unpack Patrick's advice. All right, perfect start. Let's fold the ridge. Oh, man. Wait. I think I nailed that open. Jackrabbit is all about helping guide the consumer through their fitness journey. Runners need to be confident in what they're buying. They also need to be confident in where they're buying from, and that's what we're focused on. We'll put the customer on a treadmill, we'll do a gait analysis, and then we'll pick out a few options that'll work perfectly for the runner. With COVID, we've had to change and adapt and react to how the consumer interacts with the business. Going into 2020, we were 70% brick and mortar, 30% digital business. And on a dime, in the middle of March, it turned to 100% digital. I would say that 2020 accelerated our e-commerce strategy by about three to four years. And we had to do that over the course of 24 hours. The solutions that, that Salesforce provides as a whole are huge for us as we look to grow our e-commerce business across our portfolio. Customer 360 allows us to have a single source of truth. All of our decision making is based off of that data that's coming from that source of truth. Now that we have tools like Salesforce Marketing Cloud, like Datarama coming on, we are going to be able to share that data across and understand how our customer shops with us across all of our banners. After switching to Commerce Cloud, we saw our conversion rate jump by 25%. For us, it's the key. There's nothing simple about managing a brand. Or four. So this season, the Jackrabbit sports team will share their advice across marketing, commerce, and the entire digital customer experience. The amazing Loretta Shan will help Salesforce break it down. Take it, Patrick. Simply put, these are my top three tips for digital growth. Number one, be bold with digital. More brands than ever are doubling down on their digital presence. The ones who stand out try new ways to make digital as captivating as the in-person experience. By using your data the right way, you'll eliminate the risk in rolling out your big bets. We'll dig more into this in episode two. Number two, build future-proof experiences. If you build a user experience that's so amazing, your business grows. You don't want to outgrow your technology and start all over. That's why Jackrabbit uses flexible solutions that make every experience personalized. With this scalability, a nimble team, and a startup-like attitude, they adapt fast to new success. Hear all about this in episode three. Number three, accelerate growth with an extended ecosystem. We're all better with friends. You can expand your brand online and achieve all your digital dreams with the right partners. Customer success guidance, advisory groups, expert services, and third-party apps. We'll look at Jackrabbit's expanded ecosystem in episode four. And this season of Simply Put, you're gonna meet a few members of the Jackrabbit team. Michael Rarity, head of marketing, and according to Patrick, one of the most unathletic people that I've ever met. I'm not gonna deny, deny the statement. Wow, just ruthless. There's also Zach Lonergan, senior director of digital site experience, who's in a word, intense. I am a very competitive person. It's how we get better. See what I mean? And we'll get to know Destiny Elise, a master UX designer. I think a lot of people assume that UX designers are people who just design pretty screens. UX lends itself to critical thinking. You have to think about who you're designing for. All this and more coming up on Simply Put. So click on the next video and dive right in. <laughs>